That's a good hit. I'm back with another weekly Shrip'em, two boxes of OPO6. This is video number two out of the six video series where we go through a case, Shrip'eming, investigating the reality that the bottom half of the case is just better. That's what we've concluded so far. But I need to see where Azoro exists. I know Treasure Rare Nami came out of the top box in the one video that I saw the Treasure Rare Nami, but I don't know where the Manga Rare Zoro would be. I'm assuming that, I don't know, I feel like it goes back and forth, uh, bless him, between sets, like if, you know, some, some sets the Manga Rare is the alt art, I'm sorry, some sets the Manga Rare is an SR, and some sets the Manga Rare is a secret. So in this set, the Manga Rare is a secret. Uh, the Luffy Manga Rare was a secret. And that took an alternate art slot. I don't quite remember what Shanks took. I think I think Shanks took a secret slot. Because I made a I made a reel when OP1 came out. I was opening like an insane amount of OP1. This looks like something good. No, that is good, but not the alt art. Um, but there should be three hits in this box. That's the point I'm getting at. Uh, it's either going to be an alt art leader and two hits, or it's going to be an SP and two hits. That's a good hit. That's a real nice hit. That's number two out of four. So we're almost at our, we're halfway to our playset of Onamis. Definitely a card that we, mandatory playset of that card. Uh, but yeah, I don't know like if an alt art leader oh if, if you know please let me know in the comments but i'm not sure if alt art or secret manga rares take always take an alt art slot when there is an all uh when it's a secret in the set so i know luffy was um in set one it was shanks set two was ace ace was an sr and I don't remember, I wasn't paying enough attention to the case ratios, and my video died when I pulled the Manga Ace. In set three, it was, who was this? Oh, Usopp, I didn't pull an Usopp, I, I ended up picking up an Usopp, because I only opened, I think, like two cases of set three or something like that. Set four was Sabo, and Sabo was an SR, and I believe it took an alt art slot. I could be wrong about that, but we can check my video history, because I did, shrip them there should still be i think there's two alt arts and either a leader or an sp this looks like something shiny that's a secret so we got a secret in here and then there's going to be either an sp or an alt art leader we already pulled one of the sps out of this area it was the robin that was last week's video so this is either going to be an alt art leader or an sp almost guaranteed not for sure but testing our theory, it is a leader. Yeah, see? Yamato, please. Moria, that's fine. Moria is the last, second to last leader we need. And then and then we're just missing Yamato. And then we have all the leaders lit. I don't have any sleeves left. I have to get more sleeves. That's fine. All right, going into the next box. This is our second box here. Testing our theory. It looks like the bottom of the case is just better. You get an alt art leader, and you get a secret rare and an alt art, or you get two alt arts and an SP possibly. In the top of the case, you just get one alt art, bless them, and a secret, or a box with just two alt arts and no secret, which honestly doesn't feel quite as good as it you I mean, I guess getting two alt arts, I would rather get two alternate arts than an alternate art and a secret. But getting four boxes with an alternate art and a secret, it just that's always kind of a bummer. You know? They should just they should just make it four secrets in a case and just give you a minimum of two alt arts per box. That would be cool. That would be really cool. And I still haven't seen any of these uh I don't, I don't know if it's Yonji or which Ooh, the Luffy. I love this card. I love this card. I don't know how good it is. Searcher with counter power, which is good, but I don't know how good that card actually is. Is our Dong? Um, but yeah, so this, I, it seems like the trend is continuing because we're still on the bottom of the case. This is box number four out of the bottom of the case. 
And I just want to know where I, I'm... Oh, Rebecca. Yo, this card is crazy good looking. Wow. Wow. That is a gorgeous card. And such an insanely useful card also. This card is just so strong in so many ways. Bandai Namco sleeves. Thank you, Bandai, for your beautiful sleeves and all your hard work to make this shiny card game. All right. We got to sleeve up this Rebecca. Whew. Hot diggity dog. So... There could still be, I think, I think in this box it's going to be a secret. Because I think in the other alt art, uh, in the other SP box, we pulled two alt arts. I believe it was a Hody and, um, Hody and Moria or something like that. So, I think in this box, it's going to be, uh, one, uh, another secret. So, either Zoro or Sanji which I don't think the manga can take that spot. I don't think the manga takes a regular secret spot. I could be wrong. It's possible. I would love to be wrong and to pull a Zoro manga and this would be so lit, but I have a feeling that we're gonna see a regular secret as the last hit in this video. And I was right, so there it is. Zoro secret rare, really good card. That's it for the Shrippum, thanks for coming by. I'm a dentist, I can't end without a dental tooth tip. My dental tooth tip to you would be, don't wait till stuff in your mouth hurts. When something really hurts, it's usually like too late to do something more conservative. So just go to your dentist, get regular checkups, get your annual x-rays, make sure they're checking out your gums and looking at your tongue and making sure everything's all right because it's hard to see stuff in your mouth. Your mouth's a crazy place, so keep it healthy because that's how you eat. Eating's important. I like eating, I think most people do. See y'all next week. <laughs>